Welcome back guys to my Manchester United career on FIFA 18. I'm next we've got some Champions League action here at Old Trafford. We are set to do battle with Club Bruges once again. Last time out away from home. It finished 2-1 to United. Yes we got the win. Yes we got the three points. But they uh, really did test my patience. They, they were difficult. It was mainly two players that really did test us in that reverse fixture. It was a player called Ronaldo and Abel Hernandez, former Hull City forwards, they they did make things difficult for us. And it was Abel Hernandez who did get the first goal in that game. Hopefully that's not going to be the case this time around. Romero starts in goal for Manchester United, our group stage goalkeeper. At the back, I've gone with Eric Bailly, who is back to first team duties after returning from that long-term injury. We've got Lindelof starting along with Rojo. Pogba Herrera in central midfield. That formation looks so weird. The 3-4-3 when using the Champions League graphics here. But we've got Blind, Valencia's the two wing-backs. Going forwards, Ibra gets a start for United. Bayi, not sure what Bayi's doing there, but Perisic hits that first time. And yeah, finishing is going to have to be a little bit better than that. Ronaldo, there he is. There's Ronaldo. We need to be keeping an eye on him. Lindelof gives it to... We're not getting rid of the ball here. What is this? Come on. They're playing like Barcelona. It's only Club Bruges. Just, Pogba, just please. There we go. We'll give this throw to, to Pogba. Oh, my God. It's going to be one of those games, isn't it? It's going to go on for a... Oh. It's already 1-0 to Club Bruges. What is going on? Why are Club Bruges so OP? What is this all about? Should not be happening. Ibra to blend it's a good cross into the box for Perisic it's 1-1 but only just the ball hitting the crossbar and bouncing back out thankfully the ball did cross the line the goal line technology picked it up but what a cross that is from Daily Blind good header here's Ronaldo look at him again I think I'm going to look at this guy he's untouchable and now I give up I give up this is just nonsense Ronaldo and Hernandez. I think I might just have to put a bid in for them in January. It's like actually watching Cristiano Ronaldo and Messi playing together. It's madness. Ebert to Pogba. Finasel's trailing again. It's through for Perisic. Hit that first time and he does. And he's got his second goal of the game. It's 2-2. Just before the break. Right then. Get to start over again. Ivra, nice pass to Ivan Parasic and what, what a goal that is. Here they come again. They're going to get another goal, aren't they, before half-time. Look at this. Oh, for, this is just crazy. I can't keep up with it. It's madness. Here's Parasic for a trick What a save. That is a good save. That was going in. Pogba with the corner. So if it... Marcus Rojo who hits the crossbar and Ronaldo clears Pogba over the top looking for Ibra it's in for Mkhitaryan yes yes get in Mkhitaryan 3-2 to United and in style such style on the volley brilliant look at that for a finish Pogba over the top finds Ibra that aerial presence and it just lands at the feet of magic Mkhitaryan who connects with it first time, just hits it so sweetly. Whew. Here is Mkhitaryan. Ibra just breaks away from his man. Ibra hits that first time and the keeper, again, makes another save. Here is Hernandez. Oh, that's a poor pass. Something you don't see often. Mkhitaryan to hit that first time. Get in. Get in. 4-2. Surely now the game is out of sight for Club Bruges. Surely that's put them in their place. Oh, my word. What a game this has turned out to be in the second half. Pogba finds Mkhitaryan. The defenders, I'm not sure what they're doing. But he's causing havoc there. Pogba, we're really up for it now. Here is Ibra. On for Perisic, who's seeking out that hat-trick. Might be able to get it as he's worked himself. A bit of space here. Can we Let's cross this in? Oh, almost... Finding Pogba at the far post, but Ibra on the volley! Oh, wow! Oh, wow, he deserves that. Ibra's been phenomenal in the second half for United. 
Slatan at the age of 36, 37 now in this save and is still scoring at the highest level in football. Just takes that magnificently and surely now that has well and truly finished off Club Bruges. Here is Vossen. Vossen. Oh no, 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 no! 5-3. How many goals are going to be scored in this game? He took that wonderfully, to be fair. Hit it first time on what looked like a bit of a finesse shot. Romero couldn't do anything about that. Well, football, bloody hell. <laughs> we got there in the end. We have got the better of Club Bruges once again. And hopefully that is the last time we'll have to play them this season. And in this career mode save as well. Don't know why they seem so OP. They were brilliant in the first half. And that pairing of Ronaldo and Abel Hernandez, so frustrating. The goals from Perisic, Mkhitaryan and Ibra saw them off here tonight. We are back at Old Trafford. It's United against former Premier League champions Leicester. A win here against Leicester could see us go top for the first time this season. Chelsea are only two points clear. We have been banging the goals in so far this season. We've already scored 28. It's phenomenal if we can keep that up. So for United, De Gea starts in goal. It's Bay, Smolin and Jones at the back in this 3-4-3 formation. Pogba and Matic start. Rashford, Martial and Lukaku up top. Danny Rose settling in to lie for Old Trafford down this left-hand side. That's a good cross in for Rashford. It's on target for Schmeichel. is always going to tip that over. It was straight at Schmeichel. There wasn't much power behind the header either. Maybe Schmeichel could have caught that instead of concealing the, uh, the corner. Fardy. On for Musa. Musa deadly with that pace. He's looking for Vardy. Small in, in the way, but Vardy gets his shot away, and it's De Gea that saves. Valencia finds Rashford onto his left foot. In for Martial. And both keepers at the moment at both ends pulling out some incredible saves. The goalkeepers show. I don't think we're going to see any goals if they keep this up. A ball, oh no, Moose is in. Moose is in, Moose makes it 1-0. To be fair, neither side deserves a goal in this first half. Finishing from both teams hasn't been the best as uh, the goalkeepers have been magnificent and De Gea so unfortunate not to save that. Matic, Pogba turns on it brilliantly, hits it on his left and Schmeichel saves again. Is that is that Slomani pushing out wide, trying to stretch our defence, and Smalling goes in. I had to do it. Had to take one for the team. He's looking dangerous that attack. Here is Pogba. Over the top for Lukaku. Always going to head that down for Martial. Over the top now for Danny Rose is in, but Schmeichel comes to it first. Oh no! No no no! You can't. Second yellow, and Rose is off. We're down to ten men. Rose only had one thing in mind and that was to get to the ball first and he was running at full pelt. Could he have avoided that? Vardy. Here is all Brighton. And Didi. Uh oh! Get out of here ref. This ref is an absolute joke. The amount of yellow cards he's handed out. He's handed out red cards. I'm not sure why it's saying two red cards at the top there but he's just awarded Leicester a penalty as well. Is that a penalty? Popper comes in from behind. Hardly touched Ndidi. Hardly touched him. And now Jamie Vardy makes it 2-0. It's game over. Can't believe it. This referee has been an absolute joke. Jesse Lingard. Going to cross us in. Rashford. Rashford's finishing. I mean, he's been in good form lately. It's been poor. It's not good enough, I'm afraid. Jesse Lingard, I did bring on after Rose got sent off. He performed a lot better than the players that were already out there on the pitch for United. And he'll uh, he'll feel disappointed that he couldn't help us in, in, in at least getting a goal against Leicester. It's been a poor performance here today. We need to pick ourselves up. After dropping three points then against Leicester midweek, we do drop to third in the league. West Brom overtake us just by a point. We've got Bournemouth next away from home. They currently find themselves sitting in fifth, only four points behind us. A win for them. We'll obviously see them close that gap to just one point. So we have to ensure that doesn't happen. 
taking our decent away form into account. We should be winning here against Bournemouth. No excuses. I'm going to continue to use the 3-4-3 for today's game. At the back, we've got Bay Dyer and Phil Jones starting. Going forwards, Valencia, Matic, Pogba and Blind. And up top, Mkhitaryan comes in as I've dropped Rashford to the bench after his poor performance against Leicester. Lukaku and Martial also start. Here's Mkhitaryan. He's brilliant against Club Bruges. Can he continue here today with another good performance? Here's Lukaku back to Martial. Martial is in and he makes it 1-0. Really good start. We needed that. Shame he didn't see much of the ball against Leicester midweek. But we are in the lead here. We have drawn first blood. Blinter, Pogba. I was about to say that the referee clashing with the Bournemouth players there with his shirt. I thought I'd given the ball away. But here's Valencia. Lukaku. It's in for Lukaku and it's easy. It's easy. What a cross from Valencia. Pinpoint accuracy. It's now 2-0 to Manchester United. We've now well and truly taken full control of this game. You can see the United fans in absolute raptures. We need this as well. We need those three points to continue on the pressure on Chelsea. Lukaku through for Martial. It's just Martial and Lukaku at the moment. Here's Blind. Have a good quality cross from him. How is Begovic saving that? That should be in the back of the net. We should be celebrating the third goal before half time. That was going in. And then Begovic says, no way. Martial. Here is Rashford who has come on. It's Martial again. Lukaku, why aren't you continuing your run, son? Martial. Swing this in. It's Rashford at the far post. And he's made it count. He's back on the score sheet. Rashford is back. He had one poor game. I'll give him that. But he's back to scoring ways. It's 3-0 United. And he had a similar effort to that against Arsenal. This time though. He's put it in the back of the net with the help of the post. Tremendous finish that. Incredible stuff from Rashford. Three goals. Three points. Booze all around here for Bournemouth and their players. They felt so they deserved better after their decent start to the new campaign. But Lukaku, Martial and Rashford are the players that stood in their way. Fist bumps all around. Good performance. On we go to our next game. But for now, that's it for this episode, guys. Hope you've enjoyed. See you in the next one.